Hi everyone, welcome to the sewing swap. Working with fleas can be tricky or annoying, especially for beginners or when you need to finish a project really quickly because of the thickness and the bulk of the, uh, the fabric itself, especially when it's more than one layer. But we got your back today. This is a no sew um, blanket project uh, with fringes, which makes it very um, uh, cool looking. Uh, let's jump into the tutorial. Before that, please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss the future um, uh, tutorials. And let's go! You will need two pieces of fleece, identical in size, not necessarily a set, it just happens that I have this, um, this uh, fleece set blanket kit from Joann's. You need only just two uh, pieces of fleece, identical in size, and for a fun look, different in pattern, you can use just what you have. You will need a quilting ruler, or just a ruler. You will need pins. If you feel more comfortable with um, uh, the, the clips, go ahead and use them. I'm using a 72 by 60 inches um, a piece, but of course you can use any measurement that suits you. Your favorite, your favorite tool, uh, scissors or rotary cutter. And here they are, my two beautiful prints, matching ones. Go ahead and remove the salvage from both pieces. Now we need to place the both of them wrong side together. Now have the pieces wrong sides together and inside the pretty sides of each piece will be facing you. Take your ruler and make a 5 inch. We are cutting out a 5 inch square from each side, from each corner. Now take your ruler and mark a 5 inch square. Uh, we are taking out of each of the four corners. We are cutting a 5 inch square. So take a 5 inch in. have a mark and also a 5 inch from this direction and have a mark match the two points to cut out the square. And there you go. And remember, you cut the two pieces together. Maybe you will have now to apply your pins or your clips. And here's how the piece will look like in the four corners. Just missing a five inch square. Do this four times. Now we need to cut through the two layers with um, five inches in and one inch between the pieces. So take the ruler with five inches in and take marks which are only one inch away. So one inch mark, another one inch mark, another one inch mark, one inch mark, and so on all around the four sides. 
go. I took marks five inches inside from the edge. I put a mark every one inch and also at the very edge I put marks at one inch so I can match and get a really accurate one inch wide and five inch depth for the fringe. And now this is how the fringes are made. You will take each of the two pieces and just tie them twice together. You will make sure that you will not go too tight so you change how it looks from the outside. You just stop at the edge and you tie up again. And you go on for all the couples of pieces to create the fringe all around. Can you see how it's forming? You just keep going on. Pick the two pieces together, tie them once, stop at the edge and then tie them twice. The second tie would be tighter and you are basically done. If you have done all this step for all the fringes, for all the pieces, you're done with this blanket. And, and all set. So, um, I hope you like this video. It's a quick project. Uh, especially when winter is just uh, approaching or the cold weather is approaching um, please give this video a thumbs up if you like it share it comment below and let me know if you need any further help with it thank you and see you next time bye bye